I'd like to welcome each one of you viewing, our Good News TV viewers, as well as the folks from our Arizona conference, our constituents mm -hmm. here. And we're so glad that you've joined us for this short segment. We just want to share with you what's been happening in the transition with Good News TV and the Arizona conference. I'd like to begin by saying uh, 15 years we've 15 been together, years. Luke, and this has been a real blessing, a real journey, and God is really blessed. The soul winning that Good News TV has uh, been involved in has affected many of our churches across the Arizona conference. We have had churches that have baptized literally uh, dozens of people uh, as a result of the work of Good News TV. People will view and then Good News will connect them to a local church and people will make a decision to follow Jesus and we're so thankful for that. So we don't want to lose that. We have, uh, as many of you know, in recent months, we've begun a transition to have Good News be completely on their own, uh, an entity self-supporting of the Arizona Conference, but on their own without the Arizona Conference being connected to it. Um, sadly, we live in a very litigious world and people want to sue. And so we've had the General Conference uh, Council, General Council, their legal services, as well as the General Conference Auditing Service, uh, address us, come to us and say there needs to be an arm's length relationship. They do not want these uh, um, self-supporting entities attacked because they're a part of a conference. So um, in consultation with Good News Board and Arizona Conference's uh, executive committee, we decided the best way for Good News to continue what they've been doing is to have a, a separation. Uh, but we see this as an amicable, friendly separation. No one's mad at anyone. We're happy to have Good News TV as part of uh, the Arizona Conference, um, preaching those wonderful messages and bringing people to Jesus. Uh, however, we have to do some things that looks like we're separating, uh, for instance, uh, taking the name off the tied envelope and not having the name connected in any way with the organization. So. And it also helps, you know, uh, in this litigious world, like you say, uh, people like to sue for different reasons. Yep. And so it, by establishing two separate organizations, it removes the incentive to right. try to go after the conference, for example, right. um, so that the separate organizations will uh, protect each other. Correct. Well, we still have a great relationship, and I believe it's an emotional bond as well as a spiritual bond, and we're thankful for that. So everything is going to continue as far as the mission of Good News and the Arizona Conference and our partnership working together in the foreground. It's just going to be in the background. So we'll continue to be at uh, our studio here on, uh, in Scottsdale, Arizona. Uh, we'll continue promoting the local churches and encouraging viewers to actually come to our churches and uh, for worship and for different outreach events to become part of our church uh, family. And uh, we will continue to be live streaming, camp meeting, and right. other uh, church-sponsored and organized events. And we'll uh, be promoting them and encouraging viewers to connect as well as the fact that we'll be broadcasting our English channel, our Spanish channel, our music channel, kids channel, yep. and encouraging viewers from all of these different directions to become part of our church family. Yes. Um, and so all those things in the foreground will remain the same. It's just things going on in the background that will, the main change will sure. be how people will support the ministry. Yeah. And that's an important thing to keep in mind because uh, a lot of the income for Good News TV has come because of those tight envelopes. Yeah. So you can still do it now, but as of January 1st, you're going to have to send those donations directly to Good News TV. And we hope that you do that. We'd like to see this ministry continue to expand. I believe God is really doing great things through this organization. So. Amen. As you mentioned, you know, people can donate. They can call us directly. They can go to our website. They can mail their donation for the younger generations. Yep. They can use their cell phone to scan the QR code that they'll, they'll see on their screen. So a variety of ways that people can support. Sure. So moving forward, you know, prayer. We definitely need yeah, prayer. For sure. Prayer moves things. There's no question about it. When we're praying, God is working. Uh, earnest, strong, sincere prayer yes. to make sure Good News TV continues to function the way it has been and even greater as we move forward. Would you like to have a, a I'd prayer? love to. Yeah, I knew you were going there, Luke, so let's pray together and ask God to bless. Father in heaven, I thank you for Good News TV and the ministry they've provided for the Arizona Conference all these years. And Lord, I pray that you'll continue to use them to spread the good news of Jesus' soon return and the salvation they can find in him. Uh, Lord, may this organization continue to receive the help it needs from financial support, from the viewers and so forth, and also uh, may they not just survive, but to thrive as we need to share this message as we know Jesus is coming soon. Mm -hmm. Lord, bless them in a special way. And as uh, Luke has said, bless the Arizona Conference as well. Amen. Uh, bless our uh, 
constituents to understand uh, that they have a great part to play in, in helping this ministry, Good News TV, and the ministry of the Arizona Conference. Amen. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you very much, Arizona Conference members and viewers, yeah. and thank you for all your support up to this point over the last 15 years. Right. Thank you, Arizona Conference, for continued partnership. Yes. And as we continue moving forward, um, we just want to praise God and look Amen. forward to how he's going to continue to work. Yeah. Um, so God bless you all, and thank you so much for your support and for your trust in the Arizona Conference and in Good News TV as we move forward together. Yes, God bless you, and we're so thankful you've been a part of this ministry, and we pray that you'll continue. Amen.